What up, everybody? Derek with Big D's Pythons. Um, just want to say thank you all for your subscriptions. If you haven't subscribed, please do. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up button for me as well on my content. I hope you like all my content. If you don't like it, oh well. But this is my intro, so let's get to it. <laughs> What is up, big deers? So, we have Clutch 11. Yep, I know yesterday we saw Clutch 10. Now today we have Clutch 11. Uh, I'll show you Dad. Dad is... Pastel, VPI Exantic. And the mom is an albino. 66% pasta VPI Exantic. So she finally laid and she's done. You can see there's one slug. Looks like she has a very nice size clutch in there. So let me set the camera up and we'll check this out. Alright, so there she is and she looks like she's just unraveling herself for me so I don't even get a fight with her. Which is quite nice. They set up the tub that they're going in. So I hope she proves out being hat VPI Exantic, otherwise I'll be making double X. All the eggs are out of her. So, and these are nice sized, big, beautiful eggs. I'm gonna Five good eggs, one slug. Put her back, she will get her bath later. I'm sorry, you guys can't see. 
So 575 grams. Let's check for veinies. Very nice veins. There's the embryo right there. And did I grab my marker? Again, embryo right there. Oh, these are big eggs. So of course, you know, slug, unfertile egg, yellow, 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 trash. Look at that, you can like, it's like the snake already started developing, like that's the eyeball or something right there, that little black spot. Oh, I don't know, that's two embryos. It looks like it. That's weird. So we're gonna circle here, and it was over here. <laughs> Look, eyeballs. Who knows? That's gonna be neat. All right, embryos right there. Big O embryo right there. And last one. Oh, I don't think this one's fertile. And there's like a heart shape with some blood vessels in there. That stinks. You guys see that? It's two little vessels right here. It's like a heart. Oh. We'll see. Maybe it'll turn into something. Doubt it, but we shall see. Sorry, I'm being quiet. So we got the eggs all in here now. Right down to today's day, which was today is five twenty-two. 
22, 22, and they will get cut on 7, 16, 22. So we got, what are they going to put? Oh no, I don't want to jinx it. So five eggs, number six was a slug. Sorry, hand cover and all. There's that beautiful thing. So let's go over to the giant incubator. Let's see. So these are empty tubs. Waiting for more eggs for that. So those are the ones from yesterday. So we'll push you to the back. Oh no, we'll just do this. Keep you up here, and we're gonna put these right on top. Can I turn the light on? Yeah. Yes, today's clutch. No, showing some head. Oh, not yesterday's clutch, sorry, uh, Friday. That was the incubator. Pretty nice. Nice seeing all these eggs. Alright, so now we'll come over here and update the board. So we got one second. All right, so I had to delete some stuff because I was running out of space. So uh, where is she? That's her other one. Yeah, albino. So she laid today. Five, 20, two, 22. Laid six eggs. I only believe four to be good, so I'm just gonna write that on there. If that other one surprises me, it'll surprise me. And then two bad. And then cut on seven, 16, 22. And then this is number Clutch, uh, let's fix that three, right here, 11. Those are my days, or clutches I'll be cutting. I've got 11 so far. Two of them, four and five, will be cut on the same day, which is super dope. So there's the board, so now we just got, so we got the het G-stripe that I bred to a G-stripe. Uh, she needs to lay, uh, but still got a couple weeks on her, I think, about another two weeks. Um, the spider het orange ghost, het mink ghost, uh, she needs to do her pre-shed, which she's in it right now. She just hasn't shed it, and then she'll need to lay. And then these girls, I haven't seen any ovulations or anything on yet. And then fire lesser spider pinstripe. She needs to lay, so she did her pre-shed on the 14th, so she's still got a few weeks. Uh, my Calico has not done her pre-shed yet, but she did do her ovulation, so we're waiting for the pre-shed. And then, pretty sure she's not going to go. I don't know about my Fire Lace girl. I'm hoping she goes. And then my Pastel Yellow Belly, too, waiting for that. So there's some more eggs. Whoop, whoop. I love it. Um... Yeah, it's pretty exciting. I think I'm going to have a really good season. Uh, actually, I know I'm going to have a really good season. Positive thoughts, positive thoughts, positive thoughts. And yeah. So until the next time, guys, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Tell all your friends. Hit that notification button. You know, listen, watch my videos. All of them, all the way through, please. Give me that watch time. And, you know, uh, share me so I can... Uh, you know, get up to a thousand subscribers, which I'm barely over 200. So we got a ways to go. But yeah, anyways, can't wait and see everybody soon. Thanks again. Peace.